The biggest video on the channel was the church sale where we found all that Lego, including a Millennium Falcon. And guess what? That same church is having another church sale right now. And we're going to be one of the first customers there. This time we're gonna arrive one hour early because the last time I arrived uh, 20 minutes early and we still had almost 100 people ahead of us. So this time we came prepared and we got our money in our wallet ready to spend big today at this church sale. Holy crap, I can't believe we actually see a line. It's nothing like the line we had last time. And the good thing is, it looks like it's mostly senior citizens. And usually I find they're after like jewelry and just like certain type of plates, like porcelain and stuff like that. Versus uh, the younger crowd might be into the same stuff that I'm into, like trading cards and Lego. So good thing that there is a small line and that it's not really the demographic that usually hunts for the same stuff I do. Yeah, I think we're probably the youngest people in this line right now, right? Hey, here we go. Let's go to the toy room. Yes, the toy room apparently is in the same place as it was last time. So we're gonna beeline it there right now. Oh my God, oh my God, people are in our way. Let's go. Oh my goodness. Do we see people already there? I think we've already seen people beeline it there as well. My wife is actually walking faster than me, surprisingly. Okay, so it was here, right? Okay, we are here. Perfect. All right. What do we got here? Huh. Any of the stuff here? No Legos, it's just plain old Legos. Oh, I think it's just plain old Legos. Yeah. So I see. Nope, there's nothing in there. Interesting. That can't be. That's so bizarre. How can they not have any Lego? The last thing they had a ton of it. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, so they had a Playmobil stuff in here. Yeah, technically, small cars, one dollar each. So that's crazy. Uh, I turned the camera off and I asked them if there's any Lego they have. They said someone came before the sale yesterday, before the sale, and and they sold it to them. So, uh, so someone literally came before this church that was even open and bought the Lego, which I, I'm a little bit annoyed by. That's kind of ridiculous, but it is what it is, so we're gonna have to look around for something else. Okay, maybe we'll have some luck in the book section here. <laughs> Usually we don't have luck, but uh, maybe, maybe they'll have like, just like a big box of manga, you never know. Nope. Huh. That's neat. Some Christmas stuff a little early. Some of the games here. We've got Rocky for Xbox. Uh, Counter Strike as well. Oh, really? Oh, they got PlayStation Final Fantasy. That's kind of cool. Hold on. We got another Final Fantasy here. Okay, that's kind of cool. Let's put these aside. Moto Racer for the original PlayStation. We have a Epic Mickey. Biggest Loser, Cosmic Family for Wii. So is that it for video games? Huh, that might be it, but that's, that's kind of cool. So I'm just gonna do a little research here and see if these actually are worth it. So these are looking cheap and they look to sell for the most. So we're just gonna buy these two for four bucks. It's freaking chaos here, right? Oh my God. Oh, it's the designer room. Okay, I was wondering why I was so busy right around here. Okay, let's see this room. 
Okay, so I've seen some games down here like Scrabble. Uh, we got a Sherlock limited edition game here. I could have sworn. Oh, I thought that was a, like an old yo-yo. No, it's not. Got a trivia game as well. Uh, yeah, not too much here. But I, I got excited for a bit because I was like, oh, they do have some more games. But no, not really the type of games that I'd be trying to grab. Yeah, there's Lego right there. Excuse me. Uh, those boxes there, is that Lego? Oh, no, that means... Oh, sorry. Oh, they're not for sale. Oh, okay. Were they bought before? Oh, okay. Okay, no problem. In the back of the toy section, see there's some like, action figures and things like that. We got a yo-yo. Some dinosaurs. Uh, there's not much, unfortunately. Hmm. Can you grab me that Slayer costume there? Does that actually say $117 originally? It's got the hair and everything? Okay, this might be interesting. If this is complete, you can sell these around Halloween and you actually make a decent amount on eBay. So I'm gonna ask about the price on this. How much is uh, the Star Wars Princess Leia costume? Uh, $5. $5? Yeah, I'll do five on this. All right, leaving the church sale with a very small bag of stuff. Nothing like last year, unfortunately. Someone beat us to Lego, apparently, and then there was also Lego there that wasn't for sale. So, alas, we're on our way to the car and on our way home. Okay, we are back from the church sale and we didn't have anywhere near the luck that we had last year at the church sale, unfortunately. No Lego, though there was some Lego there, just was not sold to us. We went straight to the toys and game room, which is where we had a lot of success. Last year, unfortunately, not the same success this time. We found these in the media section with the video games. There wasn't a lot of video games to pick from. None of them were like really great, like heavy hitters. When it came to value, these were probably the two best ones we found. Both these sell on eBay for around $25 to $30 Canadian. We picked them up for $2 each. Not too bad, some vintage black label, Final Fantasy games. And then we picked this up for $5. And I actually searched it on eBay and it looks like they sell between like $80 to like $150. It says right here $117. And this is like from like the Disney store as well. It is the deluxe version of the costume and it also comes with a wig, so that is really, really cool. I thought, why not grab this? I'm gonna have to hold on to it for a while though before we do sell it. And I'd probably sell it in some time around September or October when, you know, people are starting to look for their Halloween costumes. And I'm pretty sure if we list this for like 50 to like $80, we'll probably sell it pretty fast around that time period. Anyways, guys, this is it. This is our small haul from the church sale. Not much going on, unfortunately, but I still think I'm pretty happy in general with with what we got today, spending only $9. I'm estimating that this is probably worth about $120 to $150 in total for everything that we have here. So not bad for $9 spent. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, leave a like down below. And remember, may your carts always be full.